Hello guys, in today's video I'm gonna talk about the problem that uh, I faced a lot and uh, it's been really annoying so I wanted to do this video so that maybe I can pass the solution that I found to other people. So my problem and the problem was creating a MERN application and then when I try to push it to my GitHub repository this happens. Only one part of the of the project gets pushed and the other part gets like this arrow in the folder and they, it's not clickable it's like either the server side gets pushed and the client side doesn't get pushed or the opposite one side of the project doesn't get pushed so i came up with this uh, with this solution first i'm gonna start by creating a new repository I'm gonna call it just SW. I'm gonna put it private. Doesn't matter if you put it private or public. And I'm also gonna add this readme file. It also doesn't matter for you. So my new repository is ready here. Now I have this React application ready and also this Express application ready. So you go to settings for uh, preferences, I mean, and then settings, text editor, files, scroll a bit down, and you find this exclude section, which means those extensions are not visible on your project. So you should find uh, something like this about Git. Remove it from that and a Git folder is going to appear in your project. Sometimes it also appears inside the client or inside the server, inside the inner folders. So you have to search for every Git folder and remove it. Completely remove it from your application. Well, once you've done that, you start by preparing the, the repository. So git init, we initiated an empty git repository, then git add, and we add this fw folder which is the, the parent folder of the project, and you need to be inside that path, by the way, before starting the git init, make sure you you are inside the path of the parent folder of your project. So, git add. Uh, this might take a bit of time, so I'm gonna pause the video and come back later. So, I'm back and it's all done. So after that, We commit our files with this command. Don't worry, I'm going to leave the commands in the description later. So git commit minus m and you put a message for your first commit. Like first, doesn't matter what you write, it's just the first message. And you commit. Okay, next step is adding the remote, which is the link to your, to your repository. You go to the, to the repository that you created and you copy this HTTPS link and you paste it in front of this command, git remote add origin your link. And then you push everything to the repository with this command. Oops. Sorry. And hit enter.
Okay, my PC just finished pushing, so right now after this, I should find my files here. So I changed the branch into master, because we pushed through this branch, and as you can see, both project sites are pushed safely to, the, uh, to my repository. Well, hope uh, this video was helpful to you, and if you think this, this video was really helpful, you can hit like and maybe subscribe for more. Thank you.